Just long for a place that they never find I'm afraid I wake up when I die And it is too late to climb any mountain Time is of the answers The blood running through our core It's best to not feel sorry Hey everybody, welcome to a Saturday afternoon chat, boy Boy, do I have the stories for you all today. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mama June fan slam Gino Doak for a trashy tattoo. Um, so, they're currently living in Florida, but they hit the road to Knoxville, Tennessee, and June gave a shout-out about supporting local businesses as they travel. Two photos revealed Gino Doak, and the run revealed his new tattoo seemed inexplicable. Um, taken aback, there's a new photo as added. Replaced one incredibly unhealthy choice with another slightly less unhealthy choice. That's it. And another fan noted, damn, Gino packed on the pounds. However, one person spoke up to saying that he puts on weight because of his sobriety and he looks much healthier. But as fans swiped through the photos, their attention turned to the inexplicable tattoo. They seemed amazed as to why anyone would choose that particular picture. It revealed a dog, but not just a dog. The dog squatted down as they do and deposited a poop. And as you can imagine, fans said plenty about that. One of them wrote, Why in the F would he get a dog taking a poop? Oh my god. Why would you want a dog that is shitting on your arm? One follower even suggested that maybe he made a bad decision because he's high as F. Then another viewer noted, I don't understand that dog taking a shit tattoo. Is there a story to it? Thank God he got it where it's easy to cover up with a shirt. It does look terribly tacky going someplace professional or whatever. Yeah, it's, on, it's on like his bicep. He's fine. Go Gino, go. Because with all of that, Mama June got her brand new teeth, everybody. Because remember, her short $700,000 drug habit left her with teeth, teeth to match. So she got new teeth. So you got a tattoo, you know. Uh, Anna Duggar, um, basically she's saying that her life is not that bad. She just wants to let everyone know that they're not broke and life is good. Basically, that's what this article is about. She goes on to talk about. But remember, Anna Duggar, she's the one that stood by her man, the man that touched her, the sisters, and Lord, what, what, remember, what was that dating website? That is so freaking, Ashley Madison, do you guys remember that? Oh my gosh. So, yeah, so, she, she they have like six kids now. She kept letting them put babies in her, so apparently it's everything's fine. But I just feel like there's more to that story. She's making it seem like everything's great, but um, and I think I already closed it. But this is such a non-story. I was all excited that it was it was Amy Roloff, and she was giving us her guilty pleasure. She likes to watch Hallmark movies. Why is that even a freaking article? Why did you waste my time with that? And then Caitlyn Jenner, Kate Kate, was reunited with the Kardashians to celebrate her birthday. Because if you all remember, Khloe Kardashian last year was not at her 70th birthday. But she was at her 71st. All of them came together. All the gals. So, like, again, I'm going to get in trouble probably for saying this because we've been covering her for so long. But I'm like, do they say mom? Do they say dad? My assumption is they still say dad because he's still... still it, he is the same person, so I don't want to, like, take, put this the wrong way, but good for them, though. I'm, I'm happy for them. Okay, I think that's all I have to report today. Not to, but the, the dog shitting on the bicep, though. That's freaking awesome. Good for Gino. Hey, thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you all the next time. You're Bye. being rude, and I've explained it very plainly to you. You're being rude.